All right, so previous week we talked about how to search for some of the dark web sites and, and, and deep links, right? Uh, so that was one way where we explore some of the search engines and, and how to search for those services. Uh, in this episode, we're gonna see how we can find uh, the uh, like you know dark websites from the other means because search engine might or might not always work because sometimes like you know the page you're looking for is somewhere down like you know three four pages away and maybe sometimes you don't know what you're looking for uh, stuff like you don't know where to find some good exploits right so for that you have to get into some other services to find those so that's what we are going to discuss today. Uh, please hit thumbs up button if you haven't already uh, subscribe to this channel and let's get into it uh, so first one just like uh, Wikipedia we have uh, for the normal sites we have this hidden wiki uh, which as the name suggests it, it shows up all the uh, like you know hidden pages uh, the only uh, drawback with this wiki is it it will list all the links but some of the links if you start clicking might or might not work so for example let's click on this one paypal bazaar uh, i'm just i'm just testing i don't know is this gonna work or not yeah so as, as i said like some of the links listed here might or might not work because as i said like onion sites uh stay alive for sometimes it doesn't stay alive uh like you know it, it changes the address etc etc Okay, I think this one is loading. It's just going to a little bit slow, but yeah, it's not really PayPal, but it's somewhat similar, uh, the matrix. So yeah, uh, this is a really good because uh, let's say you are looking for anonymity and security. You can just go to this section. You can also uh, search for the darknet version of the popular sites such as Tor Project, uh, the New York Times, uh, the like Facebook right so uh, this is the Facebook uh, yeah and, and you won't believe that yes Facebook has onion version of it so you can totally be anonymous I don't know how it's gonna work but yeah uh, you have that as well uh, you also have for emails we are going to uh, explore that later on so how to create a fake identity uh, in the dark web because of course you do not want to uh, like you know share your actual or personal email addresses uh, and other users so that's that's one way uh, hidden wiki uh, the other one uh, is also this one is also hidden wiki but this one as you see the address this can be explored by your Chrome or Firefox normal browser as well because this one is not onion site however uh, one thing you would see is uh, if any site is offline it will be grayed out here so that's also a uh, pretty uh, like you know good feature uh, around it but obviously like you can explore this side from your chrome browser but you cannot access any of this side which is listed inside so you will still have to use the tour network for that uh reddit everyone is aware of right like uh, reddit has been very popular uh, for especially question answers and, and groups and chats so uh, this is the one uh, which uh, I mostly use to like you know maybe I don't have the question uh, I don't know the answer about some of the questions so you can post here uh, of course before you join make sure you create your fake identity and everything because there's a deep web you can also by the way just note down this is not reddit.com it's deep web so make sure you are you are in that sub channel of reddit where you can find all the uh, good stuff right uh, it people will also post like why the dark fill is down or up actually uh, dark fill is one of the thing that is one of the popular sites so that's why I think people are been asking uh, the question dread is another one uh, uh, dread is a similar uh, like you know I think we saw it last time it's it's a good search engine just like Tor uh, so yeah you can you can ask your questions here you can also follow some of the posts you can follow through the answers and probably you will get like you know you'll you'll get to learn a lot uh, by just looking reading through this the other part of other subdomain that uh, right has is the onion and here's here is the onion routing hidden services right so you'll find all the questions and related to onion network onion services here uh, if you're new you can also ask the questions here they, they also have like indexes and searches here uh, so so pretty pretty uh, pretty good site dark fail uh, this one is somewhat similar uh, to the hidden wiki uh, the only difference again here is if the site is offline it will be grayed out so you will not waste time like you know searching for some of the uh, websites 
one thing I have had hard time looking for is like if you are looking on DuckDuckGo and, and looking to find let's say Hydra and you're looking to find the onion site onion address for it it doesn't come until like you know second third page so you have to scroll down and it's very difficult but if some of the things that are popular sites you will easily be able to find on the dark uh, dark uh, dark fail or, or the hidden wiki so make sure you check that out as well uh, one last thing uh, some of the sites will also have like scam and advertisement so uh, please be cautious uh, this is not uh, like you know safe internet obviously uh, as the name suggests so make sure you uh, you do not just uh, go in and like you know click around without uh, without looking at it as I said last time instead of clicking the link directly I would suggest like copy this put it in the notepad or put it here and then then hit enter so you exactly know what you're clicking on it right uh, so I think yeah that that's what I wanted to uh, uh, like you know show you today uh, how to discover some of these uh, forums and and services and file sharing and, and all the cool projects we have here. Um, I hope you like it. Uh, play around and I'll I'll soon show you like how to create the fake identity and everything so we can you can get the most out of dark web. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave me your comment with your suggestions or feedback. How do you like it so far? And I'll get back to you next Monday. Bye.